Varev dzes ima nuna Anna je. Buongiorno. Halo, zdravo. Ich heiße Jakob. Ich komme ursprünglich aus polnischer weißrussischer Grenzgebiet, aus Białowieska Urwald. Ich bin Bekim, 27 Jahre alt, aus Deutschland. Äh, Sada živim u Belgradu, za tri godine. I studiram politički nauk. I chose the language that my parents spoke to me and this is the language that I identify myself with. So I have an Armenian background, though I have never lived there um, and I've never been a resident of Armenia. I spent all my childhood and uh, I studied in Russia and I feel um, very deep ties with Russia though when asked i will always say that i'm armenian or i come from russia i used german because in german there is a word urwald which means ancient forest very proud i'm very proud of me coming from that very specific area uh which you cannot express for instance in english with one single word and then i thought okay german has this the first language was german my mother tongue like uh which was my only mother tongue actually and the second language was Serbian, this language I am actually using the most at the moment in my everyday life in Serbia. Um, Africat. Africat? Why? Africat, yeah. Well, that's uh, the fruit that I usually eat when I'm there. That's the smell that I usually um, can smell when I'm there with my grandparents with my bigger family so that is also something very traditional um, like something that you would associate the country with the language with either standard polish language or a very strange dialect that we use in our Uwald, in our forest doesn't really have a name we would just say which means we talk by ourselves. We just talk as we talk. I mean, you know, like it's a combination of different dialects. Some coming from Polish, some coming from Belarusian, some coming from Ukrainian, some even being one time in the past influenced by Tsarist Russia. It is actually a quite short word, uh, which uh, is kuku. It is an expression uh, you use if you are surprised by something. It is actually not part of standard Serbian, but rather from a southern dialect. But it actually connects the other language I'm connected with, uh, Albanian, the, the mother tongue of my father. He has not taught me. And uh, it exists in both languages. And when I learned that this expression, kuku, is used as well in Serbian, I was quite happy because it connected me to something I knew from my childhood.